this is Lawrence from Cape Town. Quite remarkable that we can talk across the globe in this way. But before I answer this question, and it's a very big question, how is life different when you're an expression of original cause? I'd like to just mention two things that have caught my attention this last week. One, as I've mentioned earlier in a conversation, was the death of a, a, a lawyer, a human rights lawyer in South Africa, who was Nelson Mandela's lawyer in the Ravonia trial, and who worked his entire life on changing the society in South Africa, on bringing democracy, on expressing uh, courage and integrity and intellect in what he did to bring about a change, to make a difference. And that was a remarkable thing. And then something else caught my attention. And that was, it's not something I normally would pay much attention to. And it's not a program that I follow. But I heard that Keeping Up With The Kardashians is in their final season. And this show will come to an end. Now, this show represents something else, which is, I think, what could be described as narcissistic culture, a culture that looks in how, what type of impression one is making, how one's being treated, and focuses very much on the materialistic view of things and how they're happening. And I found uh, in uh, Wikipedia, they describe the show as a show where white lies omissions and fabrications are expected. In other words, that type of thing is fair game within the reality TV culture that is so prominent in the, in the national media, in the global media, I suppose. And I was thinking, we're looking at that in terms of the contrast between those two. One is a man who had courage, integrity, and intellect, and the other where white lies, emissions, and fabrications are fair game. And we're looking at what it is to be original cause, to have something at the very core of ourselves that is genuine, that is the genuine expression of something higher and finer, and that we're here to bring that, and that that makes a difference when we are that expression. And I thought it makes a difference in my life when I'm in tune at the very core of myself, I have a sense of assurance, a sense of knowing, a sense of understanding, and knowing that my expression going out makes a difference to the atmosphere in which I live, the people that I come across, to what it is to be transformative in, what, in my expression. And so I thought it's the level up from, you could say, on the one side at the lowest level, it's just all about myself, the narcissistic culture, what's in it for me. At the next level up, it's being somebody of intellect, of courage, of integrity. But we're talking about even a level up from that, where our spiritual worship, our spiritual experience is genuine. One is not just recycling the prayers and the ideas of the past, but one is having an authentic spiritual experience and being an expression of that and knowing what that is to the very depth of one's soul. And when that is the case, it really does make a difference in what one expresses, in one, one's being, and in what brings into situations. And that is transformative. And we're here to live that transform transformation together, connected and being as part of a greater whole in tune with each other.